Hello, this video is making use of dump cuts, and I'm going to show you exactly how to do them. Let's go. Hi everyone, it's Adam here from Ads Productions, and today I'm going to show you exactly how to do jump cuts in your videos, just like the one you've seen. This is very simple. Many people overlook this. This is a very powerful video technique to keep the audience's attention, so this is all you have to do. Firstly, you want to get your clip. Let's import it from my media files. Uh, where is it gone? Jump cuts. There's the original file here. You'll notice on this original file, when you import it into your timeline, there's various gaps in the audio, um, whatever it's called, audio track. So if we scroll in, you'll see here. So you've got a little bit of audio here, followed by a blank. A little bit of audio, blank, you get it. So if we do the audio, it's just me speaking. And then it's me moving on to the next bit of the cut. There we go, and there's another bit. So, all you have to do on Sony Vegas 10, click just after the audio, and then press S, or cut, or I think split, split or cut or whatever. So press S on your keyboard, and then just before the next one, press S again. Now you want to delete this whole thing, because all this middle bit is, is just repositioning. See, so you just delete that, and then you drag it over, and lock it in. Next bit of audio, let's make sure it's the wrong one. You might want to play it just so you don't cut the wrong bit of audio off. So There, there. I'll do this speed just to show you how quickly and easy it is. I'm just going to quickly do the whole video uh, like that. So you just noticed I've skipped. Let's cut it about there. Dum, 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 dum. Drag it over. Cut just after it. Hold on. Uh, yeah, you want to make sure you don't cut the audio off. So be very careful when dealing with the end of the audio clip because you might notice, like, if you say the word crisps, you might cut a bit of your s off. So it might just go crisp and end. It won't. It won't sound very natural. Even though jump cuts aren't really supposed to be a natural sort of thing, you'll see what I mean if you do it wrong. There's me looking like an idiot. Okay, delete that bit and. There, let's make sure we don't cut the wrong bit. Cool. Cut that. <laughs> That's me like falling asleep in midair somehow. Okay. Yeah, press S again. I'm literally just clicking, pressing S, clicking, pressing delete. That's all I'm doing. It's very simple. Um, there, about there, delete that clip, hopefully there's not much more left because I'm getting kind of bored now, but uh, <laughs> boom, press S, oh wait, no, you want to, that one, delete that middle bit, da da da, just at the end of the audio, that, hopefully when I play it back to you very shortly I do apologize for this but I don't like to cut the videos um, in the tutorial just so you know that I'm not sort of editing mistakes or editing little bits out you know I'm just trying to show you exactly what to do Let's cut that out um. okay so now we have it look at the result of this jump cut so now I'll go back to the site and it'll play here we go And now all you have to do is obviously render that video and upload it to your YouTube account. That's all you, all you have to do. That's the very, very simple process of jump cuts in Sony Vegas. Obviously, you can fine-tune it and master it a little, like increase levels of certain audio and all that stuff, but that's completely up to you. This is just the basics of how to do jump cuts. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave any comments you'd like below. If you would like to see any tutorial about Sony Vegas, let me know what you want to see in the comments below, and I'll take that, onto, take that into account and uh, go from there. This, this video was actually a suggestion, so thanks very much, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.